In this section, we are going to troubleshoot internet connectivity. We are going to follow the steps shown here. The troubleshooting process will not follow these steps in the sequence listed, and we will jump around as we discover issues. Step 1. In this step, we are going to confirm connectivity to the router from the inside network. Connect the computer to one of the inside ports on the back of the router. Make sure the router has power and the switch port that the computer was connected to has a link light. If you don't get a link light, then you need to check the PC to make sure the interface is enabled. If the interface is enabled, change cabling to confirm you don't have a bad cable. When you have a link light connected to the computer, select Start and run CMD. CMD will open a command window on the PC. Type in ipconfig to determine the IP address assigned to the PC by the router. In this case, 192.168.1.100. The address of default gateway, shown here, is going to be the IP address of the router. Open the browser and connect the router using this IP address. Type 192.168.1.1. Log in to the router. The default password is admin. If you change the default, use the password that you configured on the router. Now, if you don't get the router's web page, then try accessing it using HTTPS colon 192.168.1.1. Select Continue to Website and log in. If that doesn't work, then you need to check the IP settings on the PC and make sure it has been set up using DHCP. If you get the router's home page, then we verify that we have internal connectivity to the router. So, the connectivity issue is not from the inside wired ports to the router.